Yo, one sec. Today, I'm going to review Vanilla Dioruma. And I'm just gonna say it straight off the bat. I don't like it. It's not that it smells bad, but I don't like it. Fev Delicious is 10 times better than this. Uh, and I can name a whole lot of other vanilla fragrances that it smells a whole lot better than this. When I looked at the notes, I thought, let me get a sample. This looks great. It got rum, cacao, orange, vanilla, hence the name. Uh, but I was surprised to, when I smelled it that it was no florals. And I think it's perfectly unisex. On the skin and in the air, it smells really great. It don't smell great up close. And you're not supposed to smell fragrances like that. But if I don't like it here, but I like it somewhat around me, I still don't like it though, because I find, as with Feb Delicious, I find it 100% unisex. Maybe slight feminine leaning, I don't know. I find it, per I personally find it, uh, a lot of people say it's feminine leaning, but this. I'm surprised I don't see no florals, no white florals or something, because it's got that, even though, as I said, I find it perfectly unisex, uh, when you come, when it comes down to niche fragrances and all that, like, when you get into that, like, most fragrances, do you know, it's, it starts to become unisex, but this got that, I know Dior is a designer, but I, think the Privé line is niche um, or niche style of perfumery. Uh, this smells like a good ingredient designer fragrance that has that feminine aisle touch uh, when you walk into a department store. It smells like muddled of a lot of good fragrances and some bad ones i don't like it like i like it but i don't like it i would never buy this i would never wear this after the three four wearings i have it's strong and it's potent people will like it of you but most people will probably like this fragrance you will probably like this fragrance, but for me, it's a no, no, uh, yeah, it's a hundred other vanilla fragrances I would pick over this. Um, nothing comes to mind, but probably um, uh, in a designer niche or designer uh, role, I would probably pick uh, Baby Cat is a hundred times better than this even mercedes spends um mercedes spends uh, black club black that is better uh, like as i said dior like dior um, um fab delicious dior fab delicious it's much better. It's it's the same like um, uh, creamy like vanilla tonka in the background as Fab Delicious, but they made it like this floral. Even though it's not listed or it it goes way feminine, but at the same time it's not feminine. I would wear this if I liked it because it's not that feminine. It, it got some cheap shit, that's what I'm trying to say. It, it got something I don't like in it, and it's simple as that. I'm trying to over-explain it. I can't. It's something in here, and I don't like it. It's a good fragrance, yes, but I don't like it. I can appreciate it for what it is. And it's like Dior Sauvage. I can stand it on my own, 
uh, on myself. But when people walk past me, I'm like, hmm, that Dior Sauvage smells great. Even though you're tired of that shit because everybody wears that. But yeah, when people walk past you and wear Dior Sauvage sometimes, it's like, wow, that shit is good. But on me, it's clothing mess. And this, same. Don't like it on me, probably on somebody else. I'm probably going to give it to my girlfriend or my sister or something like that. Or a, a buddy if he wants to wear that shit. But I don't. So yeah. Peace.